life. What up, guys? This is Chivo Guides back here again with another video. Today, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to go fast in Roller Champions. This is a brand new free to play game by Ubisoft. It's available on Xbox, PlayStation, and PC. On top of that, it does have crossplay. So you could be playing PC players, PlayStation players, or even other Xbox players. Now, when you first start the game, it takes a while to get used to the controls. I highly recommend playing the tutorial, of course. But even then, you're going to realize that all of the other players are going to be going much faster than you. And it could actually take a while to figure out how to go fast with the ball and then without the ball. So in this quick video, I'm going to show you guys how to gain a bunch of speed with the ball and also without the ball. As the way we're going to handle getting speed is going to be different depending on whether we have the ball or not. Now, number one tip I want to give for beginners is rather than pressing jump, press B. B is uppercut and it's a much higher jump than the actual jump button. First and foremost, I want to point out you can only do this without the ball. So let's go ahead and talk about how to go fast without the ball. First and foremost, you want to skate into one of these half pipes. And then once you start skating up, you want to press B to uppercut into the air. Pressing B to launch yourself in the air is going to launch you much higher than if you just press the jump button. Now, on your way down, you want to make sure to hold right trigger or R2 on PlayStation. Your character is going to crouch down for max speed. And pretty much anytime you're on a decline, you want to hold down right trigger. And you're basically going to do this back and forth. You're going to go up a half pipe, press B to launch up it. You're going to press right trigger to go ahead and pump down and then you're going to press b to jump back up this is how you're going to gain a bunch of speed when you do not have the ball this by far is the easiest way to gain speed in this game this will enable you to gain some speed that way you can launch yourself in front of one of your teammates and ask for a pass now the only thing with this method of gaining speed is it does not work if you have the ball because when you have the ball you cannot uppercut so we're going to have to change up our method of gaining speed just a little bit for when we have the ball a matter of fact we're just going to change one button so rather than pressing b to uppercut up the half pipes we're going to end up pressing x instead you're basically dodging into the half pipes after you dodge up you're going to hold down right trigger to pump on the way down and we're going to rinse and repeat this process so when you don't have the ball you press b to launch up the half pipes and when you do have the ball you press x to dodge into the half pipes in either way whether you uppercut or dodge your way up you're going to press right trigger on the way down. And to clarify for PlayStation players, just in case you're watching, rather than pressing X to dodge into walls, you want to press square. Square is how you dodge on PlayStation. So just make sure that you dodge into the half pipes to gain a little bit of air and make sure you pump on the way down. And these are some of the best tips that I can give you while playing Roller Champions, especially if you're brand new to the game, because this will help you keep up with other players that have been playing for a while. It'll also help you catch up to players that haven't been playing for a while or don't know how to gain maximum speed. Now, there's a few other things that you can do to gain some speed. However, I would consider these methods advanced skills. So if you want to get a little more advanced with it, you can go ahead and roll the ball in front of you up the half pipe. That way you can go ahead and uppercut up it, which goes a little higher than the dodge, and you can gain some speed and grab the ball on the way down. It's basically a self-pass. So as you get better, you can learn how to self-pass. You basically wanna hold left trigger, you want to aim down into the floor in front of you, and it's going to roll it in front of you. If you do it right, it'll roll the ball up the half pipe. You'll press B to jump up and get it, and you'll be able to pump on the way down. Again, this is called a self-pass. It's a little more advanced, but it's another way to gain a lot of speed while you have the ball. It's just a little more risky because, of course, it could get intercepted, or you can miss your self-pass. So yeah, that's going to cover some basic tips and tricks for you guys on how to go faster in the game, which I think is super important, especially if you want to get some wins. I'm actually going to be uploading a bunch of more guides for Rollers Champions, so if you guys are looking for a specific guide or tutorial, let me know down in the comment below, and I'll try to make one for you guys. Aside from that, make sure you guys keep an eye out for some more Roller Champions videos. As always, I'd like to give a huge thank you to all of my Patreon subscribers. We just hit 12 patrons. I'd like to give a special shout out to everybody in the biggest fan club, including TimG84, Kegger101, Kana25, and GamertagNation.com. As always, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe.